before me. Hungry, terrified, clutching your babes to your breast. Emperor Emir has marched his legions into our lands, laid siege to every fortress from here to the Blue Mountains. Rabid and ravenous, he bites and bites away. Men of the North, you stand at the precipice. Your kings have failed you, so now you turn to the gods. And yet you do not plead. You do not kneel to dust your heads with ash. Instead, you wail, why have the gods forsaken us? We must look into the trials we failed long ago. In a time past, our world intertwined with another through an upheaval scholars call the conjunction of the spheres. The gods allowed unholy forces to slip into our domain. The offspring of that cataclysm was the nefarious force called magic. Yet we did not banish it, instead studying the vile arcane for our own power and wealth. And the monsters at our door, the unholy relics of this conjunction, the trolls, the corpse eaters, the werewolves, did we raise our swords against them? Or have we laid this burden on others? On so-called witches. Stray children taught the ways of foul sorcery. Their bodies mutated through blasphemous ritual. Sent to fight monsters, though they could not distinguish good from evil. The flicker of humanity long extinguished within them. <laughs> yes. Their numbers have dwindled through the years. But a few still roam our lands, offering their bloody work for coin. To this day, they shame us with their very existence. The North bleeds! Flogged by war! The battles are the gods' whip, chastisement for our sins. And let us not forget the terrors, the scourges from beyond our world. The wild hunt rides the sky with every full moon. The Dark Raiders abduct our children into lands unknown. Some say they herald a second conjunction. Can we chart a course back into the light? Will we find the strength to banish the mages from our kingdoms? Unite around the warmth of the eternal fire. Nigh is the time of the sword and axe. None will fight this war in our stead. Hello, this is Brandy, aka Pixelated Twix. If you're new here, welcome to my channel. And if you're an OG, welcome back. This is the first episode of The Witcher Wild Hunt. Now, I have played through this game um, almost two times. I did start another uh, gameplay and didn't get to finish it. But here we are uh, again for the third attempt. And I wanted to make this attempt um, public on my channel because I really enjoyed this gameplay or this IP and CD Projekt Red just happens to be one of my favorite game studios so you guys have to know that I'm really excited about CD Projekt, uh, CD Projekt Red's new IP which is Cyberpunk you guys I'm so excited Cyberpunk 2077 releasing next year April uh, yeah, in April, but we went off into a tangent. All right, so, um, this is sort of a blind playthrough because I did not get a chance to, uh, venture into the expansion packs, which is Hearts of Stone and Blood and Wine. Um, so that'll definitely be something new for me. However, the main storyline is not a, um, is not unfamiliar to me. So, um, uh, but the one thing I do know with The Witcher, your choices do matter, and those choices can differ um, or have different outcomes um, depending on what you do or what have you. The storyline can change a little bit. 
or the outcomes, I should say. Yeah, I know what I'm talking about. <laughs> anyway, so uh, we're going to go ahead and get into the game. Um, I will be featuring this uh, every Wednesday. So yeah, anyways, let's get into it. We're going to go ahead and start a new game, not continue. And yeah, let's go. So we're going to get a fresh start. Not going to do new game plus. Um, let's start off with story and sword. And then I believe I'm going to upgrade it with blood and broken bones just to see uh, how intense I can go. I've never tried death march. I'm not truly insane, at least not yet. But, you know, who knows? All right, so story and sword uh, tutorials. Let's just put them on. Um, simulate Witcher save, I guess, on. All right. Freaking awesome. Uh, I'm so excited about the the new um, series coming out on Netflix.
and find that amusing. It wasn't meant to amuse, but to prod you to hurry. It's midday already. You promised Siri you'd train with her. Go before Vesemir bores her to death with those etchings. See you later. Okay. All right, welcome to the tutorial. Tutorial? Welcome to Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. This tutorial will introduce the game's core elements. Each message will be saved in the glossary, where you'll also find detailed information about world lore and gameplay mechanics. To disable tutorial messages, go to the options menu. All right. So, let us use our Witcher senses. Wow, Witcher senses to find the key to the bedroom door. Um, yeah, mini map in the upper right hand corner. Blazy, blah blah. Um, there we go. Witcher sensors, senses, sensors. Why do I keep saying that? So let's look. See. You're running out of juice. You might bring me some more once you're done training. Oh, there's quite a bit to look at. Gold clashes with my complexion. You should know that. I'm a silver girl myself, Yen. We're just gonna let the, let it go with the garage door once again. All right, those are my spells. Got any clothes that aren't black or white? Hmm. Undergarments. Okay. And here's our key. Kara Morin, quest updated. Okay. So go to lower level and let's talk to Yen first uh, before we head out. I think we can talk to her, yeah. I hate that garage door so much. Okay. See, I thought Siri could stand to wait a little longer. It's uninstructive. Not to mention unreasonable. Um, let's see. I want to stay with you a little longer. I missed you. A lot. And I missed you. But we'll have plenty of time to make up for that. Go and train with her. Then come back. It'll give me a chance to put my face on. Of all the women I've known, you're the only one who does that before. You've known many. What's it matter? Only ever thought of you. Good one, Geralt. Okay. Great recovery. Um, I think that's it. Nothing else. Let's go out here just in case. 
I'm gonna be a little more thorough with this uh the mountain pass is beautiful as ever. Look how gorgeous. Same. Okay, let's head out. And down the stairs to the lower level. I'm so excited about being able to play this game again. Um, it's been a while, actually. It's been a while. Uh, <laughs> um, so I'm going to be, as per usual, a little rusty. Um, not as much as Dragon Age, though. I think I recently played this within the last year. Old Witcher's fast asleep. Series disappeared somewhere, of course. Man, those views. This is such a beautiful game. Guess she prefers practice to fearing. Hmm. What? Time to wake up, Master. These lessons so boring they put you to sleep too? Damn it. After taking notes on ghouls and owl ghouls, wanted to rest my eyes a bit. <laughs> Making her slog through that brick? No wonder she took off. John of Bruges lacks flair, true, but he's reliable. Not like the hogwash they print nowadays. She's tackling the pendulums, right? How many times do I have to tell her? Don't train alone. It only embeds your errors. Bring our young damsel to the lower courtyard. If she wants to practice, she'll get to practice. Ah, uh, we've spoiled her. Gotta admit, we've spoiled her. We've spoiled her. I've been saying it from the start. Siri needs a firm hand. Been saying that true. But you let her walk all over you just like the rest of us do. <laughs> Fine. I suppose I'm partly to blame, but this has to end now. Killing monsters is not something to be taken lightly. Siri must understand that if she's to become wise. I'll see you below. Oh. For what I remember, there's not a lot of female or no female witchers now i see why you were so eager to practice strike you're not in the circus pirouette Wrong. Footwork. Enough. Get down. With a flip? What do you think? All right. Take off the blindfold. You've got work to do. Your reflexes are still slow. Maybe for a witcher. Think drowners or striggers will go easy on you because you haven't undergone the mutations? Though in your shoes, I'd fear Vesemir more than any strigger. Disobeying his instructions? Unwise. Well, yes, but that book was horribly dull. I know, and you know that's no excuse. <sighs> I'm sorry. It won't happen again. Uh, better not. Better not. Vesemir said if it does, he'll make you eat a bowl of slugs covered in salt. <laughs> you! Exactly. So you'd best behave. Come on, we'll practice with the others down below. Shall we run the walls? Of course, let's begin the tutorial. Of course. Is a witcher school or an elven bathhouse? Alright. <laughs> Maybe if you fall. Oh, come on. Get a little rusty on the control. Wait a minute. There we go. What did I tell you about breathing? E Hear them with your steps. Siri, 
cut it out. <laughs> okay. Now I think I'm getting the hang of it. I'm not going to let her win. Sorry. <laughs> I don't care, kid or not. Ugh. <laughs> Wait, where am I going? Am I going this way? Whoops. Okay. I cheated. Ooh. Imagine. Anything to say for yourself, young lady? I'm very sorry, Uncle Vesemir. Young blood craves action, I understand that. But when you fight a beast, knowledge counts as much as your silver sword. At the very least, you ought to be able to tell a ghoul from an owl ghoul. By markings, like unto the panthera tigris that in Zeracania dwells, and by the sickly paleness of its visage. Mm. So you did read the chapter. Still, you should have asked if... But you were asleep, Uncle Vesemir. Yeah. Well, could have said that you did the exercise while Vesemir was asleep. So you did the reading. Why not admit it right off? Never pounce on an advantage as soon as it appears. Wait till it stands to have maximum effect. Uncle Vesemir's words. Well, you're a quick study. Quick, but mischievous. Fine, we've talked enough. Geralt, you're with me, Lambert with Estel, Siri with the dummy. Again? Stop groaning and grab a sword. All right, time for some training, aka tutorial. What do you think? Should tutorial? We start by reviewing the fundamentals or go right to free training? Let's review the fundamentals. How about that? Yeah. Let's just do that. Should work on the basics. Even skilled masters need to hone the fundamentals, and Ciri's barely a novice. A.K.A. I am. Alright, so witchers must be prepared to fight foes of all kinds, be they pl plate-clad knives, knives, I can't read, knights, eth ethereal, wraiths, or bone-crushing giants to match the strengths and exploit the weaknesses of different enemies, Witchers need to use a variety of weapons and combat techniques. The core tools of their trade are their swords, one steel for fighting humans and non-humans, the other silver for slaying monsters. Witchers have also mastered a simple form of combat, magic. These signs are not as powerful as the spells wielded by mages, but they can be very they be cast very quickly with simple one-handed gestures making them quite useful in the heat of combat. All right, so enough of the reading. Draw my sword. How do I do that? Oh, press one. Press one. Uh, F to select my target. And, okay, press F. Okay, left shift. I'm hmm, sorry. Remember. Uh, to dodge, uh, indicated, indicated direction using WSDA and press number. I'm going to have to change that, but okay, let's go. Um, so... Okay, 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 okay. I can't do that right now. Really? Okay, so... Oh, nine. Okay. Yeah, definitely gonna have to change some things. Rolling is nine, and uh, let's try this. Yes. Come on, come closer. Pretend now, live later. Repost, 
Counterattack. Oh. <laughs> uh, come on, Vesemir. All right, press tab. Quinn, which is here. Cast active sign, press Q. Okay. Oh, okay. Am I supposed to? Oh. Ah. Igni. All right. If not for the Quen sign, I'd be a flame by now. All right, Geralt. Come on. Okay, okay. Now what? Ard, okay. So Ard is active. Is it? What the blazes are you doing? Having fun. Okay, select the Ard sign using and then okay. See that Siri? Ard will knock anyone or anything off balance. Destroy their rhythm. Time for Axie. Okay. I hate this feeling. Axie. Walk close to Vesemir and press Q to cast your sign at him. Uh, Axie can really muddle your mind. <laughs> Show her, Geralt. Cast. Okay, so Yurden is. All right. Okay, I just want to make sure that it's active. Okay. Okay, so bomb. Okay, tutorial over. Um, okay, so, um, stand, okay, I didn't mean to do that, okay, press and aim, okay, okay, fine, enough, continue training, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. <laughs> Jeez.
All right, Tamaria Road to Visima, May tw uh, 1272. So obviously that was a you all right? nightmare. <laughs> Had a nightmare. About? Take forever to explain. Dawn, some way off. We've got time. Uh, I dreamt of Caremorn. Started in the guest room at Caremorn. Relaxing in a tub, and next to me, Tris, Yennefer. Funny, isn't it? She's never been there. Seems so real in my dream, though. Was she nagging you about something? <laughs> True to life, indeed. We'll find her. Um. Then we train with Siri. In the dream, I went and found Siri. Trained. Those were the days. Hmm. Little she devil. <laughs> I've trained kids who were faster, stronger, but none had her character. Didn't end well, did it? Your dream. No. A wild hunt appeared, attacked Siri. I couldn't move, stood there like a stump. It was just a dream. Siri in my dream is, might mean she's in danger. That's the problem. It was more. In the past, when Siri'd appear in my dreams, something was wrong. She was in danger. We taught her how to defend herself from anything, wraiths included. Um, time to go. Dawning soon. Time to go. Wait. Show me the letter from Yennefer. Might have overlooked some hint in there. Didn't overlook anything. We were meant to meet in Willoughby. That's what she wrote. Meanwhile, one army or another burned the village to the ground. All we can do is follow her trail, so... Stop talking for a minute and give me the letter. Ah. About that, it does smell of lilac and gooseberries. We're gonna read it, not sniff it. They must meet soon. Willoughby near Vizima. Hmm. Nothing else to guide us there. What's this postscript? I still have the unicorn. <laughs> uh, stuffed unicorn. Yeah. Stuffed unicorn. Once or twice, certain situations. Hmm. The things young folk get up to these days. Back on topic. How's it look? How far behind Yennefer are we? Two or three days. Trail's fresh. But it looks like it leads towards the main road. Could be muddled there. Wait. Hear that? I hear it. I do. Ghouls. All right, life on the continent. Blah, 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 blah. Yeah, we don't need to read all that. I will definitely let you read it at your leisure. But until then, uh, we're going to go with it. Uh, How long are you going to make me wait? Oh, okay. All right. Striking opponents generate adrenaline points, certain abilities you can acquire. 
allow you to perform special attacks that require and consume adrenaline points. Your adrenaline points slowly decline when you are not engaged in combat. Of course. Okay. An army's past necrophages follow. Let's go before any more show up. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and loot. I actually might install a mod um, that will um, allow me to just like do an aerial loot uh, rather than me trying to try to run around and try to find um, the uh, uh, let's see there it is I think yeah everything that I haven't looted because that can be annoying all right so we are going to stop here for today and uh, the next episode, we will go ahead and follow Vesemir uh, to the, I guess, the next town. I do thank you guys for joining me for my first episode of The Witcher 3 uh, Wild Hunt. I hope you enjoyed it. If you have, or even if you didn't, drop a comment below and give me a like if you if you like. Otherwise, um, if you haven't become a member of our family, I hope you consider subscribing and clicking the notification bell so you know when I upload. Until next time, guys. See you later.